so welcome back to the software testing tips and tricks channel so if you haven't subscribed this channel please subscribe and today we'll talk about uh, how to upload the files using the playwright so in last video we talk about the how to download the files and we handle the download event and we wait till the download finishes so upload works in the reverse order so we need to upload the file and wait till the upload happens and once upload is done we need to press the submit button so that uh, upload will be successful so to make sure like every time uh, file uploads uh, happen successfully and playwright waits uh, till the file upload happens we need to handle the events so for that we have class called file chooser and this provides uh, set file functions to upload the file and uh, this file chooser event is there so first we will go uh, write the code and we will see like how it will uh, work and once it is done uh, we will <coughs> I will uh, explain the documentation. So let's uh, write the first. So first we need I have created already created that file upload.spec.ts and uh, I am creating now page class uh, context dot first we need to create new page <coughs> and we need to use await. So I have created page class now I need to page dot first again await page dot uh, go to so we need to go to that website that uh, I have copied I need to copy the URL so this is the sample website I am using which allows me to upload the file and see the file uh, so this is just a very straightforward way to learn this so uh, we are going to this uh, site now uh, we need to check the code so we have this like start waiting for file chooser before clicking not no await so first uh, we need to wait till this file chooser event occurs and we are not using await because we are writing in javascript so it keeps on waiting till the file upload events occur so before uploading file we need to trigger this event so we are copying this let's copy the message also and we are pasting here so we are first uh, waiting for the file to upload and uh, we are not waiting so this will this line will wait till the upload happens after this uh, we need to uh, write our uh, locator and we need to click on that so this is where uh, upload button is there so let's check it out so here i need to go to choose file so this is the input so i am writing like xpath only input and uh, this input had some properties name equal to a file so we are getting exactly that locator now so we can use page dot locator and we can pass that locator and click on that so this will click on now that locator and now we need to use file chooser so in file chooser we have function called set file so in set file you can uh, provide the path of the file uh, which you want to upload so i have created uh, one sample file dot txt welcome to the software testing tips and tricks channel and please subscribe to this channel and this is sample file so this is i created in test folder itself so i am providing that file path dot slash test slash sample dot txt so this is the what uh, my file path is so i have created this file path and we will upload this file so we need to click on press so that we will get that uh, <coughs> uh, file what we uploaded and uh, it is successfully uploaded or not so let's uh, click on press button so it is submit button so i need to its input type and it submit so i got exact one locator here so <coughs> again we need to click await page dot locator dot click 
So now we will upload that sample file and click on the submit button. So let's try running this. So it has a go to our PRL upload file and here you can see the file they uploaded and this is the content. So we get the content and uploaded file successfully. So this is how upload works. You can try larger files and other file format as well. And uh, uh, main thing here is like you need to handle this page dot on file chooser event that we have done here. So it will wait till that file choose uh, happen and uh, file uploaded successfully. So again, like if somebody is the larger file and uh, you want to get time out, right? Sometimes it keeps on uploading and you want to time out. So for that, uh, we have option. So we can set the default timeout method. And uh, in options, like file chooser has uh, two options. Once we have give file the path of the file that we have done. Also, we can uh, give here comma and timeout. Like is a uh, get upload timeout after this this much time so for that uh, we need to no wait after you can use or you can use timeout so for that you need to give the timeout so in playwright we need to give timeout something like this so this is how you can give the timeout <coughs> so this all like if you have any doubt feel free to ask and uh, Please subscribe this channel and share it to your QA friends. Also in social media, I keep on sharing funny memes. So please uh, check those out. So thank you.